Hey guys, welcome back to One Girl's Opinion. I'm your host, Tina Lynn Ashbourne. And as and you know, before I do anything, I want to say thank you all for being a part of the Opinionated Mafia. I now have 142 subscribers. I am 8 subscribers away from that next goal of 150 and I am so excited. I can't wait to reach 150. So make sure that you subscribe if you have not already and share the video so that more people can join our uh, little mafia here. Um, so the first thing I want to talk about, do y'all see this mess? Okay, listen, this is what happened. So the land that I was renting, um, they had told us it was going to go up a little bit because of Second Life's new tax policy. So we were like, okay, I was like, okay, you know, that's fine. They said it was only going to go up a tiny bit. Y'all, it went up $10 a month. It was like two fifty a week. Now, I don't know about y'all, but $2.50, like, that covered the, the taxes for the whole land. Um, I just, I felt like it was really, because there was a lot of parcels on that land, and some of them were more expensive than mine. So, I know with, like, just probably two of those parcels it was covering the taxes but ten dollars a month it was to me it showed greed and it was really insane to me um so i found some new land i have 2250 prims and i'm paying i believe it's 1249 i'm basically paying two dollars more a month instead of ten dollars more a month so i'm okay with that and i picked up the house and the driveway and the little back patio thing and it went fine and I picked up all the stuff inside the house and it went fine. Then I set all the stuff down and try, when I went to move it, it all went haywire. I'm going to show you guys. Look. Oh, let me fix myself first. I forgot. So, look at this. Look at this. This is a mess. I've been working on it, but it's just been... Ugh. Look at this. Look at this mess. Like, stuff is all over the place. There's stuff outside in the air. My cats aren't happy. Well, Raul was. He's enjoying looking at the ocean. All I've done is here is Amadeus's section. I did the, the dining room and the kitchen. I started in the kitchen and been going from there. Like, the upstairs looks awful. Like, wait till you see the outside. I did this area by the front door. Let me out. Y'all, do y'all see that house across the way? That's the Roost Mitchell. The Roost Mitchell. I love that house. And I seriously thought about putting it out. And I tested it with the DBY kitchen. It didn't work out. The DBY kitchen is too much for it. Let me show y'all what, what the air looks like. It's ridiculous. Look at this. Stuff everywhere. There's stuff all in the garage. Like, there's stuff all... <laughs> this is... This is bad. Oh, goodness gracious. So, I've been dealing with that for the last two days, and I probably will be dealing with that for at least a week, because I'm not going to be doing it any kind of fast. I'm going to do it slowly. I don't, I don't need to rush. So, um, in today's video, we're going to be doing a product review, and what I did for the product reviews is I put a platform in the air, and then I put up a little house so that furniture and things like that I can demo in the house. And then other things, I have like an area to demo. So we're going to go up there um, to the air and check that out in a few minutes. Um, but first, let's get into the blogger's corner because this outfit I'm wearing is super, super cute. Uh, so let's do that and then um, we'll get into the review. Okay, welcome to the blogger's corner where I tell you everything I am wearing. And every once in a while, I showcase the product. And as you can see, I am in the air over the stairs because this is where I found my blogger's corner ball. Everything up here is everywhere. It is chaos. Please pray for me that I don't go insane. It's going to be crazy. So the outfit that I am wearing, um, it's super cute. The t-shirt is from the Bo Llama. Y'all know how much I love my Bo Llama. It's called the Lucky Tee. And this shirt is the hunt item for the Fab, the Fab Free St. Patty's Hunt. It is three Londons. 
And the hint for this is, get your pens and papers ready. I'll give you a second. The hint is rainbows are definitely the main ingredient for lemonade. Um, so make sure that you go and uh, do the hunt. The florals will be in the description box below. Uh, and it's a steal for three lindens. You know how much I love my bold llama. The pants are my new sponsor. Thank you so much for sponsoring me. I really do appreciate it. Um, they are the Charisma Designs Leva, Le Levy L-I-V-A pants. They're really cute pants. These are actually, um, I'm actually wearing them on Legacy, but they're for, not for Legacy. They're, this is actually the Maitreya pair, but I think they look pretty good. Just you know, hide some stuff and there you go. The shoes are KC Lima platforms. My hair is from Faga and it's the Alika hair. And then obviously I'm wearing Yami, Vixen, and Orsani. Um, and with that, roll my intro and let's go check out my product. Okay, so this is the product review. Um, this is called the Why Not Renach Kitchen. It's a really a cute kitchen, I do have to say. Um, so before I get into my review of it, uh, let's talk about some uh, facts for it. So number one, it is 124 prims. Um, that is my one of two complaints about it is that it is so many prims. It has couple and single animations. The stove, sink, island, refrigerator, and stools are all animated. The lights and the microwave turn on and off. The backsplash has three different textures that you can change it to. Um, all the doors and drawers are scripted to open. All the decor comes with it and it is also separate so you can take it away, which means you'll probably see it in my house. Um, and it does have some different colors, like the stove, for instance. It comes in, like, this really pretty, like, orangey or red color. It is very beautiful. Um, I really like the stove. Okay, uh, so let's do some testing, and then I will give you my opinion on the, on this, on this thing. So first off, since we're right here, let's try the, um, refrigerator. And the refrigerator, I'm gonna open both sides. So it does have some things in the refrigerator. It's all really nice quality stuff. So you can, I'm not sure, I'm just looking. Or you can raid the refrigerator or you can get a snack. Next we have the stove and the stove has a couple different things. Um, male or female, you can be chatting, get wine or beer and cooking. You can be frying, stirring, or cooking steaks, and it does give you, um, like a spatula so that, you know, it looks realistic. So as you can see, you have a spatula there, uh, and then you can be stirring or cooking some little, little steak items like that. So those steaks look good. Let's see, you're, you're cooking the steaks, and you can see that, um, you have different things that you can, um, that you get to res. And then the next thing is the sink. So with the sink, um, you can be doing singles or couples things. Uh, you can wash the dishes or drink coffee. And as you can see, you do get a plate and a sponge to wash. I, I love that. And the second thing that I don't like is that you can, it doesn't give you the, it doesn't give you food. Because all this food looks really good. Like, look at that cake. All of this looks amazing. So all of this food, the flowers, the plants, um, the little tea and coffee set, the cutting board, that all comes with this set. Um, and it's all, like, individual. So you can take it. Do you see? It's all, it's all individual. And it looks like the decor, these um, avocado toasts. Ew. Is uh, two land impact the cake and the other things were one cutting board with cups two apples eight the plants are five but it's both of the plants and the apples it's like a whole bunch of little different things right there the cutting board 
uh, three and the T set is three. And then as you can see, everything opens, which is amazing because you can even put things in the, um, in there for like, if you're doing pictures or whatever, and the backsplash, that's texture one, texture two, and texture three. Now, as for my review of this, um, oh, and then the, the stools you can be sitting or drinking. Um, now, as for my review of this kitchen, I think that it's a really cute kitchen um, if you have the space for it. Because as you can see, it's kind of large, so you really need the space for it, number one. Number two, you need to have a lot of primps because it is 124. It's awfully primmy. Uh, you're not putting this kitchen in a linden home or something small, that is for sure. Would I, would I recommend buying it? Sure, uh, if this is your thing. I think it's cute, and it's definitely, it's definitely something that I recommend if you have the prims for it, and if you have enough space in your kitchen. Like, um, for this, you can tell that, like, there's no space right here at all. So, it is a pretty large kitchen, um, but overall... 9 of 10 recommend. Okay guys, that was the Why Not Ranoff Renoch Kitchen. I hope that you like it. Let me know in the comments section below uh, what you think. Um, before we go though, I forgot to show you the nails that I'm wearing. So I'm going to give you a close up real quick. Okay, so these nails are from Tulsi Studio, and they're called the Forest Nails. They're really cute nails. Um, I will leave the description, the slural in the description box below, so that if you need some nails, you can go and pick them up. And with that, thank you so much for watching. Um, make sure that you subscribe and share the video so that we can get more followers. Uh, to join our opinionated mafia and also don't forget I do have a patreon now and I would really appreciate it if you would take a look and possibly sign up uh, I do have some things in there right now but I do plan on you know adding things as time goes on uh, with that thank you so much for watching have a great day I will see you in the next video bye